So now the English lesson is finished and now this is a short film on what's going on now. The door, helping the house mother, making dinner. Lovely salmon fish cakes. Resisting stealing more of those fish cakes. And out here, we have boys painting the cafe door. Wow, that's extremely good. A good idea. It's all getting very exciting. Right, the cafe will be open soon. It's been used for the classroom just now. Well done, kids. Over in the main house, those who aren't helping in the kitchen or outside on the door are busy with their art space time. Relaxing with the music and working hard on their pictures. That's excellent. Bay, hiding hers under the table. Oh, happy birthday, mate. <laughs> it's Mo's birthday. And round the corner here, we have no work, uh, go even, <coughs> working all on his own. On his little masterpiece. Which is going to be excellent when he's finished. This was one completed by Bong yesterday. And Ty finished this one off. That's one of my lazy efforts. Came to this art going a bit later, I think. Still, it's good fun. That's the first in a series that will be completed, I don't know, over the next couple of weeks, maybe a month, on the beach of the children. Well, there was done by Andrea, our Austrian volunteer, who was with us for six weeks up until a week ago, a couple of weeks ago. There's a wall hanger by New. As you can see, a house full of art, a lovely place to live. Murals from last year. Plenty of space for more. Oh, can't see those, they're hidden behind the car. Never mind. Come and visit us, you'll see them all. This lovely little piece was one of the stool painting efforts, but the stool was not so good so we just took the top off and stuck it on the wall. Lovely job. With my 
camera will stand this little bit of rain. This is the recent bit of garden we did at the front of the house. It's now growing very well, full of wondrous things. Lime trees, orange trees, flowers, garden mint over there, planted by the house mother. More herbs and stuff for the garden in this piece. Over here was, is, <laughs> not was, it's still here, um, <laughs> the fish pond donated by our friend Jochen. Um, children worked very hard on building up around it. It's under the concrete is a whole mass of clay and straw that children used to fill in so we didn't have to use absolute tons of concrete. This little piece of relaxing garden is slowly building up with more plants and flowers. Uh, in the bottom section of this tower is going to be the mushroom growing house. And up there, still waiting, is new news tower. We are waiting for someone to come and build us proper steps just here. Nice safe steps for the children. Um, let's see. Here we have what will be the bicycle park. It needs concrete in, but the rain is holding that job off. Um, but then we'll be able to park the bicycles nice and tidy. Down here is new vegetable growing area again we're waiting for the rain to stop so we can get some topsoil delivered to fill this large plot in at the moment it's full of the remains of banana trees which will hopefully help feed the soil when it goes in there and we will continue in this fashion all the way around the site to make it more manageable and more useful um, utilize the space that we've got more vegetable growing less buying at the market and down here we have a small bed that is currently planted out with spring onions and there will be more I'm gonna have to stop now because the rain's getting a little bit too heavy for my camera See you again. Back in the kitchen. And Jaws on something else now. This looks wonderful. Eggplant from the garden, I believe. Excellent, excellent, excellent. It's going to be a birthday dinner to remember. Let's just have a quick look, see how far they've got out here. Wow. Look at that steaming cup of coffee. And <laughs> Zach's doing a very strange. <laughs> I don't know what to call it, but it's wonderful, Zach. It's great. Looks lovely. Plate of food over here. Oh, and a roasted chicken. I don't know whether we'll be doing that. We haven't got an oven. So never mind. I might have to buy an oven now. Anyone want to donate? <laughs> if you feel like donating either the oven itself or the money to get one, I can get one of the glass um, ovens from Macro for about 3,000 baht, which we could roast the chicken in if we wish to. I'll have to do some coffee making training. <laughs> that would make me want to come here. That's excellent. Uh, 
another great day at Stratton House. This is what happens when you let Zach free with a paintbrush. He goes crazy. <laughs> Wonderful. Just before dinner, everybody's come out to join in on the doors. Good. A little bit from everybody. That's an amazing job in just one hour. Oh yeah, these kids are amazing. <laughs> 